Jaipur has traditionally been famous for block printing, tie and dye and many other hand printing techniques. Over the years, a number of entrepreneurs have tried to cash in on the city's expert artisans, but only a select few have been able to apply their techniques with great aplomb. Here's the story of one such company. Twenty-seven years ago, Naresh Jain could foresee the demand for Jaipur's block prints and decided to step into home furnishing. Little steps that began with a small block printing unit have today turned into a giant leap. With a company of 800 people manufacturing home furnishings, apparel as well as handmade paper products. Ratan Textiles has successfully taken advantage of everything that Jaipur offers to entrepreneurs. Jaipur city is very famous from the very beginning for the print. It's called the print city. And the climate and the artisans which are, the climate is one of the major thing. And the second is the artisans. And Jaipur has a lot of art and architecture and you know, those kind of things happening around. And those influences definitely affect the crafts people, people in the design field. Sunit Jain is the CEO of the company and a second generation entrepreneur. He drives the growth, marketing and production plans of this 40 crore rupee company. The most important one was, or rather is, is the design aesthetics of the company. Which is, which is one of the main things which has driven the company uh, on, the, on the growth path. Number two, uh, most of the things we have done are cell phones. So whatever we did was we kind of built up the production facilities so that we could control the production and, and the quality of the material. 80% of the company's products are manufactured for export. But Ratan Textiles has carved a niche for itself in the domestic market too. By supplying products to the heritage hotels of Jaipur and with four retail stores in Delhi, Jaipur, Goa and Kolkata. Exporting to 25 countries and exploring new markets in Latin America, the company has aggressive expansion plans. We are building up a new factory in the SAS, in the Mahindra SAS, which is uh, uh, duty-free zone. So that's a very strategic decision we took because, uh, of course, uh, there are a lot of physical advantages. But sitting in a duty-free zone, we now become a global player. We can source raw materials at the most competitive price. Ratan Textiles is a unique confluence of the traditional and the modern. While the company began with block printing, today it owns a new age digital printing machine that can replicate any design with surprising speed and accuracy. And even though it is not very cost effective at the moment, it is indeed future ready technology. Very, very good traditional craft skills such as the block printing, the bandini, um, very good contemporary ones such as the digital printing. Um, and what's most interesting here is the fact that they're layering the techniques. Many exporters are quite unilateral in the way they operate and Ratan are integrating the techniques, which is a big advantage. Jaipur's textile and apparel manufacturers share a camaraderie that is rarely seen among business rivals. While there is competition among manufacturers, there is also exchange of knowledge, ideas and often even customers. The scale of competition is, is on a very positive note. How to grow the business without undercutting the other. Best of my competitors, the most staunchest of competitors, are free to visit me here. They, of course, they come often. Whenever we have issue, we come and talk. The competition is on quality, design, and product styling. It's not much on, on price. So the moment you keep the price out of the game, the competition becomes healthier.